Now I'm going to discuss about the DRAND method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function here after that go inside. So at here I've taken five integer time variable A, B, C, or D and N. So at here enter the number. So uh, this are uh, displaying to the output screen. So first time I'm going to enter 153. So that is a uh, on strong number. Sorry, whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by n. So at here n become 153. Now next a equal to right here a equal to n by 100 so 153 if i am going to divide by 100 so it to or divide by 1 times so a become 1 right here now b equal to n by 10 so n is now 153 153 by 10 so it divide by 15 times so right here or uh, this value is now 15 and of uh, 15 more 10 so the remainder return at here 5 so b become 5 and now c equal to n mod 10 so n value is now 153 so or 10 in for 153 mod 10 so and your remainder return 3 last digit number is 3 now so c become 3 now here after d equal to a into a into a so 1 into 1 into 1 1 plus and your b value is now uh, 5 5 into 5 into 5 so 125 And uh, next, our uh, C value is now 3, 3 into 3 into 3, or uh, 27. So right here, total it become 153. So right here, or uh, check n double equal to d. So n value is now 153, and or uh, right here. So this all value go to D. So D value is now 153. So at your 153 double equal to 153. So that go inside and at here it return Armstrong number. So it display Armstrong number. This time I'm going to check none Armstrong number. So this time I'm going to enter 152. So whatever I'm going to enter, so that uh, received by n. So at here a equal to n by 100. So 152 by 100. So it divide by 1 times. So a become 1 now. And uh, b equal to n by 10. So 152 by 10. So it divide by 15 times. and uh, 15 mod 10 so the remainder return at here 5 so at here b equal to 5 now now c equal to n by n mod 10 so at here 152 mod 10 so uh, remainder at here return 2 because last all digit 2 is so C become 2 now add here uh, the value of uh, A so D equal to triple A triple B triple C summation so add here 1 into 1 into 1 so it return 1 and uh, B value is now 5 5 into 5 into 5 125 And uh, C value is now 
Oh, two, two into two into two, so total eight. So if you add this on, so it become one twenty six, and one twenty six plus eight, one thirty four. So add your uh, d value is now one thirty four. So I have to check the condition if n double equal to d. So n value is now 152 and d value 134. So both are not equal. So that go else point and I have to display not Armstrong number. So this is the dry end method of this program. So you try with any other number like 172. 175 198 so if you check with 370 and or uh, 371 so this is or uh, two years this two numbers are armstrong number so both n equal to d then it or uh, display armstrong number so i hope guys you understand the dry end method of this program so thanks for watching see you next week